Hello, I'm going to be doing some example solves. The scrambles will be in the description. So looking at the scramble, the first things I notice are these two, which are the same, and these two, which are the same. But I think I'll solve on this side in this orientation because of the pin positions. So now I need to memorize the back or the moves I need to do for the back. So this one minus this one, negative five, plus this one minus that one. So negative five plus negative four, that's negative nine, which is equal to positive three on the clock. Then my next number to memorize is this clock minus that clock, which is four. So, so far I have three, four, then I memorize this minus that, which is three, and this clock minus that clock, which is two. Next, I subtract the this amount, two, from five. I get five because it's on the five hour position from 12. So three is my final number. For my memorization, I use English numbers for zero through six, and Sino-Korean numbers for negative one through negative five. This means that negative one is ir, negative two is e, negative three is sam, negative five is o, and negative four is sa. So altogether, my memorization is three, four, three, two, and then three. So to preserve this, while doing three, which was the last number I memorized, and then and solve this, and now I have all of this. And now I use the first number I memorized, three, and then four, and then three, and then two, and then I'm done. Now I'll do the next scramble. So immediately looking at this, I see these two. So this is the best case just from looking around on it. So. I'm going to be solving it in this orientation, but this is the front. Now I need to memorize the back. So this minus this, one plus this, this minus this. So one plus negative two equals negative one. And then this minus that, two. No, I forgot this. This minus that, which is two. And this minus that, two. This minus that, six. So altogether, my memorization is going to be ear two, two, six, and then zero. And there wasn't, my final number was zero, so I don't have to do anything. And then ear two, two, and then I can solve that, solve that. Now on to my next scramble. So looking around, I notice these two and those two. I think I'm gonna solve it in this orientation just because this pin is up. So it'll be a nicer start. So now memorize negative three, four, so one, and then negative four, and then negative one, and then three, and then five minus three, two, so one sa ir three, two. So two, one, 
sa ir ku done. Now on to the next scramble. So quickly, I notice these two, I notice these two, and I notice these two. I think I'm gonna solve in this orientation using these two as my lucky pair, just because these two and those two would require less smooth pin transitions. So now on to memorizing. So I have one, four, so five, and then negative four, then five, and then negative four. So five saw, five saw, and then six. So six. Five saw, five and then it's done. So now on to the last scramble. First thing I see is these three, so I'm gonna solve in this orientation. So now on to memo. Even though the pins on this side aren't great, it's just really good either way. So negative five, negative one, that's negative six, which is the same as six, and then this minus that, which is one, this minus that, which is four, this minus that, which is two, and then uh, eight minus two, which is six. So all together, that's six, one, four, two, six. So the last number, six. Six, one, four, and there. I hope that this video was helpful in some way. It's my first time recording a video like this, so please tell me what I could do better in future videos in the comments or if there's a tutorial or something you'd like me to make. I apologize if the clock went out of frame sometimes. So I'll try to edit those solves out, but I really tried my best. Thank you for watching.